Hello and welcome to the SITS Pyramid webinar. So the SITS Pyramid is the meditation size pyramid that is a part of our Ascension Pyramid lineup. Um, we started with the, the largest eight foot tall pyramid and we needed something a lot more portable because it's not just about being within the pyramid itself. It is also the area outside of the pyramid that is affected. Um, it just brings through this field of peace, of that neutrality, of quantum harmony. Um, it's just an amazing field. So we decided to make the smaller version, which is a mini pyramid, which is the same uh, design style of using the copper tubing. Um, and with the mini pyramid, it's about 14 inches tall. Um, it's just a wonderful portable one. And then everybody's been asking for the, the meditation size, the, the style that you can fit within your bedroom and be able to actually use it underneath the pyramid. Because within the pyramid, it's a lot more intense of an energy. It, it truly is that, that field of neutrality within that pyramid. Um, so please do check out uh, the other webinars on the Ascension Pyramids as well because they give a little bit more information that I may not cover here today, but we will certainly try to cover all the basics. Um, I won't be able to take any questions because I'm far away from the monitor, so hello everybody who is uh, attending live here. Thank you for being here. Um, so with the, the sits pyramid, it comes with basically the, uh, the leg extensions and the mini pyramid kit. So the mini pyramid kit contains a variety of really phenomenal tools on their own, which one of them is the larger um, cosmic sun disk. Now this tool on its own is really a powerful tool. You can use it on the body above the head it just does so many openings and just bringing in all those higher torsion fields it's working on the physical body um, on the cellular level so the cosmic sun disk is a phenomenal phenomenal tool so this right here is not only half the price of the meditation pyramid the sits pyramid but it is a huge component of it um, to create that spin that flow and that connection so the cosmic sun disk is one of the five pieces that is needed in order to make this ascension pyramid function. The next uh, set of tools is the harmonic creation field trio. Now these are actually the ones that we use for, for our water rings. Um, the trio here contains the regeneration ring, the golden fire ring, and the earth resonance ring. So this trio together Again, if you check out the Harmonic Creation Field Trio um, on the product page, we have a webinar and, and other places as well. Uh, we have videos out there about the attunements that you can do with these, which are pretty phenomenal. Just these alone are creating a field that is bringing in our light more than what we've ever seen. Um, it is doing the, the release work, the clearing work, the connectivity work. Uh, just with these three. And this is actually, you know, if that looks familiar, that is the gateway pendant that we create or the gateway phone tab. It uses the same trio of rings um, for, for those tools as well, just because this three together is super powerful, um, amazing, amazing field. And another powerhouse is the Wings of Talk. So the Wings of Talk is just another one of those space holders. It's creating that column of light, it's creating that high vibration space and bringing through so much support for the person. Um, so adding the Wings of Talk to this configuration is just amping things up even more. Again, these are all phenomenal standalone tools. Um, but yeah, we do have, again, the webinar on the Wings of Talk that walks you through how to utilize this tool um, for, for doing other work besides just using within the pyramid. Another phenomenal tool is the, uh, the Regeneration Gaia Sphere. 
So this particular Gaia sphere is the one that is doing the, the heart connecting with the, with the heart of the earth. It's a very grounding, but yet expanding tool. So this is just the, the fourth piece of the puzzle here of creating that ascension pyramid. So these are the, the standard pieces that come with the pyramid kit, the mini. Uh, and so this comes with the mini pyramid as well as with the sits pyramid kit. The other component is these are the legs. So these are the end caps that go on the base of the mini pyramid. So if you get the sits pyramid, you can actually take it apart and you have all the components for the mini pyramid, which again is about 14 inches tall, which you can just set anywhere in the, in the home. Most of us keep them right in, in our bedroom uh, because of the field that it creates. It is truly an amazing field. So if you're not using the meditation pyramid, you can always leave it set up or if you're traveling, you can pull it down and you can use these, the leg components because uh, this cable system keeps the, the uprights on the pyramid at that 60 degree angle. So let's get started on our pyramid then as far as the poles. So the half inch copper poles all come in this really tall, wonderful shipping container, reusable PVC pipe. Um, it has the screw off end on it. So this way you can carry your pyramid to the beach, anywhere, mountains, wherever you want to go. So it's pretty simple, easy to assemble. Now, unlike the original eight foot tall pyramid, this one doesn't use the um, cables on the feet. So this one uses the cables that keep the poles apart up here on the top part. So that way, with the smaller pyramid, you can get in and out of it without tripping on the cables. So it's easy to set up. You just set it out, you create that perfect little X in here, that 90 degree angle. Um, and the beautiful thing too about these pyramids is they are very forgiving that you don't have to have everything set up perfect to each corner exactly you know that um, in an exact square this can be a very um, imperfect setup as far as the geometry goes and is still anchoring everything in it is the 60 degree pyramid angles and all this all the poles are cut to sacred measures so this in itself is helping to anchor everything in now again it's not going to bring the full effect of the ascension pyramid until all the tools are on. So usually we'll put the harmonic creation field trio just up on top. Now with this little netting in here, this cross member, it's a great place to set the Taurus. And you set your wings of talk on there. You can actually hold the Taurus. You can actually put all the tools anywhere inside or on top. It doesn't matter. Now, with our other pyramids, we've always had the Gaia sphere sitting on top. That is only for aesthetic purposes. You can have the Gaia sphere within it on top. You can be holding it. It really doesn't matter. So that right there is the full setup. Now, again, right here are connector pieces where you just pull this top portion off if you wish to make the mini pyramid. And so you pull that top portion off, you pop the leg spacers on the bottom of the mini pyramid, and, it's, and there it is. So with this setup, it is going to be radiating out. Um, this expands throughout the entire home. Um, basically, there's an energetic pyramid that just expands up. It is larger than a home, and it's expansive. If, you, if it's needed to be larger than that, it, it occurs. These tools are very much working with us, the, 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 the greater us of each individual that, that is within their field. 
So again, that's the beautiful thing about the Twisted Stage tools is that they do work with the higher soul self and they're bringing through everything in your highest and best good with all the gentleness, the ease, as much as your soul allows. Now, this is a rather intense pyramid once you're inside. Now, with the camera angle here, so I'm sitting flat down right now. I'm just sitting flat. And um, the torus right above the head is that perfect spot for the torus. Now, inside of here, it feels completely different than it does outside. Inside, it just brings that, to me, it, I don't know if you notice the change in my voice and my demeanor, but it just pulled me right down into the heart. Um, it just feel more at peace, at ease. Now, you can sit in here as long as you feel guided to. I've actually slept underneath of one of the larger pyramids. I did it for six hours. I woke up. Um, just a little bit too much for me. Um, I did it a couple nights in a row. And, um, you know, you can sleep with on, within these, but it's recommended just to spend a few minutes a day under here. Now, the nice thing is, is that if you do have one of these, you can sit under it for your meditation, but also for any time that you need to reset, that you need to ground, um, or do your release work or do any of your energy work. You can do it right here from within this pyramid and then it can still be set up and it radiates out through everything um, throughout the entire home. So there are a lot of different meditations that you can do within here, such as activating that quantum heart, um, stepping into that field of neutrality, going beyond the mind, stepping into that field of knowing. Um, there are a lot of meditations that, that we put out there on our twistedsage.com resources page and on our YouTube channels. Um, and then we're gonna be having a lot of upcoming uh, webinars here over in, in about six months. We'll have a space to where Brenda and I will begin to do more webinars together and but there is a plethora of already meditations out there that you can do within this pyramid that are just going to be amplifying the work that we do. Um, the 50 questions Friday here, uh, I believe it was May 22nd, um, or it could have been the one before there, we did a quantum heart activation, which is really a powerful, profound one. On the 50 questions Friday, usually at the last five minutes of, of that series, we do meditations and a lot of them have to do with utilizing the mini pyramid. So again, please do check out all the other videos out there because there's some great information on using these fields that these pyramids produce. Um, and one last thing with these Ascension pyramids, um, these are creating a grid. It is what we just discovered last night and call the Ascension grid. Basically, we are pinpointing where all these pyramids are at. Not exactly. So if you purchase a pyramid and you live in like Birmingham, Alabama, I'll just put Birmingham. We won't put your address, but we do put a general location of where these go. And we have a map out there that people can see where these grids triangulate. Um, so we probably have over oh, 40 of these out in the world as of today, uh, but we're getting ready to release a new set of gridding tools that connect to these pyramids. So these are holding space for us on earth um, to create a larger grid that just assists the earth and humanity. So when you are, when you get one of these, you are also helping to expand that ascension grid that we've been working on. Um, it really is a profound, powerful tool. So, um, you know, it's, I've never been a huge salesman, but I tell you what, you should really get one of these things. They are really super profound. Um, because, you know, the, the reason that we are doing and what we are doing is all about expanding consciousness, raising vibrations on the planet. 
And truly, every person who expands, it, it shifts this world. And these are simply tools to help us do it faster um, and with a little bit more grace and ease most of the time. So anyway, thank you for being here. I appreciate you guys and, and the support over the years. And um, I'll just check the monitor really quick to see if there's any questions. Um, and no, well, yep, actually we have some questions here. Let me check the questions tab and see what we have. So Christopher asks, I understand that we have that the pyramid needs all the components to be complete. However, if I had just the leg pieces, the legs, and a small harmonic creation trio, would it be sufficient enough to do some good work? And yes, you know, you can have just the, the pyramid structure. And it is a great space holder, but it's not going to be anchoring in that ascension pyramid etheric template so in order for this to hold everything that it is on the energetic level it does require the tools here but again we are getting ready to release something super exciting soon which is the the grid pyramids and uh, please do keep an eye out because they'll be released here on June 1st of 2020. We'll be releasing um, a couple of styles of gridding pyramids that can basically create the same field outside of this pyramid as what this pyramid does. But anyway, let's see. Would you, would you, okay. I'm gonna read a question here real quick. Um, would you put your head at the center? And you know, the thing about these, and you can have your head right at the center, um, right underneath the torus, but basically with these, it's any time that you're within this pyramid is that field changes when you're right inside of here. So unlike a lot of the, the Giza pyramids and the other, you know, the, the pyramid structures that are on the planet, there's that sweet spot right in there that is the center focal point for the inside of the pyramid. This isn't so. This is basically just a space holder. So as you step within this field, it is the same energetic anywhere within here. But yet, having your head close to where this torus is is phenomenal because this torus is, again, dropping in those higher torsion fields, those higher Merkaba fields. Um, so, um, yeah, there it is. We try to make the tools as simple as we can um, because that's really part of the whole new paradigm is being in the heart space, doing things with simplicity, trusting, surrendering to your alignment and not having to go at them with more of the logical and specifics. Um, simplicity is really the key in most of all this. So anyway, we've got just another comment or question here. Let me check. Um, and then to, let's see. <clears throat> and then any of the questions that we have non-related, we're going to save for our 50 questions Friday tomorrow. So please come back for 50 questions Friday. Um, the other question again about the top part being removable for the mini pyramid. Yes, this is, and let me actually show you what we have here, you guys, because there's a lot of you who actually own the mini pyramid already. And so for those of you who actually own a mini pyramid, or you just wish to create a component, what we have is simply sliding these poles out. Now this right here is the mini pyramid. So with the mini pyramid, we take the legs and we just fashion, fasten the legs end caps right here on the bottom of the pyramid. And then that creates the mini pyramid structure right there. 
<clears throat> so if you order the medium sits or the, the medium pyramid, the sits kit, the sits kit comes with this whole and complete mini pyramid kit right here. Now, if you already own a mini pyramid kit, we actually made it so that you can purchase the legs only. So the legs only, the leg extensions only for the sits pyramid are these guys right here. And so you see we have the cables that keep them together at the appropriate space. So you just take your um, mini ascension pyramid and you pull the end caps off. And some of these might be hard to come off. So if you have a mini ascension pyramid, you might need to use some extra grip or force to get those end caps off. And then you just slip it right on to the, the uh, poles right there onto that receiver part. And then you have that mini pyramid or the sits pyramid. So if you order the leg extensions only, they do come in this larger tube. So that way, if you already have the mini pyramid, you just receive this, you put your mini pyramid structure on there, and then you have a carrying case or a storage case for your entire pyramid structure. So, let me double check questions here again. I about need somebody else to run questions for me. <laughs> so, um, yeah, thank you guys. Again, uh, we really appreciate your support here at Twisted Sage Studios. There's, um, you know, we there's a lot of families that are, are employed here, and we we really we we work hard to produce the most beneficial tools out there for your, for everybody. Um, because again, it, it's it's all about all of us stepping up raising consciousness, um, shifting this planet. So again, thank you. All right. Namaste.